Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rich Johnson and in today's tutorial, we'll be talking about how to list your products and Facebook Marketplace. Now guys, if you're living in a country where you can see this icon, which is called Facebook Marketplace, then you should be selling items, whether it be new items or it be used items, because you can definitely make a lot of money financially selling on Facebook Marketplace. Now guys, I'm living in Jamaica where the jobs in Jamaica they don't pay much so if you're living in Jamaica you definitely should be selling items on Facebook marketplace now the first thing that you want to do guys when you're gonna be listing your products and Facebook marketplace is that you want to look at your location what this means is it tells you who will be able to see your products when you list them on Facebook marketplace and it also tells you what products you use if you want to buy products from Facebook marketplace so yes guys you want to adjust this if it doesn't suit you so you can choose to come closer to your location or you can go wider depending on where you live because I wouldn't advise persons to actually sell to persons in other countries when you come into Facebook marketplace because that would be very difficult especially with the shipping and all those things okay guys so the first thing that you would do guys is that you'd click on this where it says create new listing you click on that and then you click on this if you want to sell an item if you want to sell a vehicle you do this if you want to sell a house or rent a house you'd actually click on that so I'm gonna go ahead and click on this because I'll be listing a product and guys uh, with this account because I actually have multiple accounts, this is not my main account I want you guys to let me know if you're you are able to list in a hundred plus places because uh, most accounts or accounts that I know only let you list in 20 places so yes guys I'll be showing you how I actually list in so many places that most accounts can't so I'm gonna go ahead and show you but the procedure to actually list a product I'm gonna show you that also so you're gonna go ahead and you go and click on this to add a picture of the product you'll be listing so I'm gonna go ahead and select these three pictures and guys with Facebook marketplace the more pictures you actually list the better it is for your product that you want to sell because the same Facebook profile can actually see your products three times let's say you list three different pictures of the product if you list four they'll actually see it four times that's the reality of it and if you're having difficulty getting views I would advise you to actually increase the amount of photos that you put for your listing okay and the next thing you need to do now guys is actually name the product now you can actually copy and paste the name of the product that you originally bought if you were if you bought it online or you can actually go look at uh, keywords that persons are searching for on Google which is normally what I do to see what's going on in my country what the persons are actually searching for so I actually go to Google Ads and you can already set up an account and get a keywords for free so this is what I do I'm gonna go in and type in portable sewing machine because basically that's what I want to sell so I'm gonna go ahead and type in that okay and then I'll click and get results okay so you can just click on this to bring up the larger search results okay let me see if there's any other keyword that I want to use uh, let me try this one and see what will happen okay so yeah I can use some of these keywords which are actually ranking higher so the first one that I'm going to actually use is this one, sewing machine. I don't want to use ones that the product, the product is not. So I'll leave off the brand names when I'm choosing. I can use this one. It says portable sewing machine. Okay, and I'm going to put part of the name of the product. Let me see here. No, this one is not what I want. Okay. Let me see. You can also use this.
ok um, what's the price that I'm gonna be selling this for ok so this would be a thousand Jamaican dollars category that I'll put it in I like to put the, them in appliance because that uh, category is actually widely searched by persons in my country it's new and for the description I'm gonna go ahead and put this and the description I believe is the first thing that the persons looking to buy will actually see uh, now this is where most most persons actually don't put anything but I always try to put something let me see here I'm gonna go ahead and select some of these you can select up to 20 I believe okay and then I copy it and then I paste and I'm gonna use commas to separate them okay so this is what you want to do guys you want to ensure that you make sure that your items are ranking even if it's not showing up on the browsing page if someone were to search for it it will actually come up on the top so they can actually see it to purchase it because your listings will not always be doing well but if you actually do good optimization whenever it's searched for which is not very popular with Facebook marketplace they don't normally search for things they normally just browse and what they like they purchase but some persons actually come to search if they really need something so yeah so next let me see here if everything is good so you have the pictures you have the name let me put this right here Okay, you have the price, the category, condition. Okay, so next guys, I am gonna list this in other places. And this guys, you will have to actually put yourself in some local selling groups. So you can see all these when you actually go around this section. So I'm gonna try to list as much as possible in these groups. As I tell you, the no, the, my normal accounts, they don't allow me to list in more than 20 places. So I'm going to show you how um, this account, for some reason, is allowing me to list in all these other places that are way past 20, 100, doesn't matter how much, guys. And if, it, if you have an account out there that is able to do this, you let me know why this account is able to do it and why your account is able to do it because I need to find out so I can actually allow my other accounts to actually do this so as you can see guys the box is already grayed out but it's still allowing me to actually list in more places for some reason or another it is definitely working for this account but the other accounts those are not working guys so if you know the glitch that Facebook has, you let me know. Okay. Okay guys, so now it's actually finished and as you can see, I have listed my item in more than, this is over 50 places guys, literally. It's crazy. And now I'm gonna go ahead and publish it okay guys so as you can see guys I've not been getting a lot of views for the one that I recently list but I do get a good amount of views for the older ones and this is a account that is a new account basically so you can actually have multiple 
accounts and if they actually turn it to be like this one that allows you to leave list in many places then it's perfect so yes guys this is how you actually list your products and facebook marketplace to make an additional income and who knows you probably want to do this full time and have this as your main job so yes guys thank you for watching you take care bye bye